Cam, I have to ask you, uh, as a horror fan, can you give us uh, your top five movie recommendations that people need to watch? Okay. Uh, my favorite horror movie of all time uh, is Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I love the original. Um, and it's not gory. It's not. It's just it, the first time. If you have never seen it, and, and I'm, if you've seen it, you'll know what I'm talking about. The dinner scene mm. is still, I still watch that and still feel that every moment of that, that whole scene. It's just so, it was filmed so, and it's such a, just a dirty, gritty, disgusting 70s like <laughs> film. Like you literally, when you watch it, you feel dirty, you feel sweaty. You feel like you can watch this movie in the middle of winter and still feel disgustingly sweaty and grimy and the humidity of Texas. And just when you get done, you feel the dirtiness of that movie. It, you you, you, you want to take a shower after you watch it. <laughs> so that's my favorite all time movie. And the second favorite horror movie is Evil Dead. I've, I've probably seen those two movies more hundreds. I can't even count how many times I've seen it. Now, those are my two, top two favorite. Right. Uh, third, like I said, is going to be Fulci. I love the Fulci films, and I will go with the Fulci trilogy. So I'm going to say uh, City of the Living Dead, which some people know as Gates of Hell. So it's called the Gates of Hell trilogy, which is followed by my favorite Fulci film, The Beyond, and then finishes up with House by the Cemetery. So I'm going to lump that in as kind of like the third because you got to watch all three of those. But I also love Zombie from Fulci, um, the the original Zombie, which is weird because in Italy it's called Zombie 2, but it's Zombie everywhere else. Mm -hmm. Um, Only because it's called Zombie 2 because originally uh, the original um, Dawn of the Dead appeared in Italy as Zombie. That was the title back in the day. So Fulci followed that up with Zombie, which in Italy is called Zombie 2. But it's a little little horror nerd uh, information there. <laughs> um, so that, and then I'll say probably, uh, it's this one's a hard one. I'm going to try, I'm trying to think what would I would consider a fourth, but I love the original Maniac. Mm-hmm. Uh, I love that film. It's just, that's another one that you, it's just gritty and dirty and disgusting. And like, you just feel when you watch that, you just, cause it's, it's like the next eighties, you know, it's, it's a Tom Savini early, uh, you know, when Tom was Savini first started off and it's just the whole Joe, Joe is just such a character in that. And he's just, he's so greasy and dirty and filthy. And then you, you watch it and you're like, ah. I feel dirty and greasy and filthy watching this shit. <laughs> you know, like it's a, and you get, and just you don't get horror movies that give you that feeling anymore. It's either shock or or you know, but I love horror movies that kind of give you that sort of feeling. And then I guess fifth would be um, I'm going to go with the original Phantasm. There's just something about that man. It's just just it, Don Corielli just did an amazing job of making that world. I mean, uh, Tall Man, the whole the original i mean the first is just a brilliant it's just brilliant yeah fantastic all right good stuff got some recommendations for halloween hey man listen cam thanks very much for coming and having a chat to us Uh, i really appreciate it i think you've done a fantastic job with resurgence it's a great death metal record i'm fucking loving it i love the artwork i love the stories i love fucking everything about it and thank uh, you thank you congratulations and i know it's 10 days early but man happy birthday and enjoy halloween Uh, thank you thank you i appreciate everything thank you Hey, this is Cam Lee from Massacre, and you're listening to The Metal Bar.